Hey guys, today I got some brick eaters for you. Literally, they eat bricks. My name is Patrice. I live in London and I'm addicted to eating bricks. Oh, Patrice. Patrice. Why, Patrice? Why? When I eat brick, it's like a drug to a drug addict. You feel good for a while until you need it again. Hold up! She really breaking her house's wall to get her fix. Know what this reminds me of? She ain't gonna use her material to build. She gonna eat it. You feel good for a while until you need it again. You could just hear her go into town and it just crunch, crunch, crunch. You get like a little cringe feeling. Hold up! What? What is she? That's her husband. But what is he eating? He got a brick addiction too? But obviously to Patrice, it's heaven. <laughs> I started eating brick in my late teens. Damn, so it's been a while. This is an ongoing thing. For at least 10 years, she's been eating brick. And you know what rhymes with brick? What eating bricks makes you. I got the idea to do it from my grandma who told me that my auntie and uncle, when they were kids, they used to dig the wall and taste it. One day I ended up trying it myself and I couldn't really stop. What? So her parents encouraged this. This is a genetic thing. It's been passed down from her grandparents to her parents. Oh, your mom and dad. Oh, they used to eat walls. And now this bitch was like, okay, you know what? I'm gonna try it. And she tried it once and got hooked. This is how addictions happen. Guys, don't try it. Don't eat walls. You will become addicted and you will end up like Patrice. In 12 years, Patrice has eaten half a ton of bricks. That is the equivalent of 8,571 crumpets. I like how they compare it to crumpets. <laughs> That's a lot of crumpets. But I mean, some people actually eat that many crumpets in 12 years. That's like eating two crumpets crumpets a day. So when you actually do the math, that's not that bad. But when you're eating bricks, hold up, this bitch literally <laughs> shits bricks. She eats it, it's gonna go out. So she shits bricks. She can say that, she's like, I'm going to the bathroom. I literally have to shit bricks. Throughout the day, this is about how much brick I would consume. I eat brick from my bedroom, my grandmother's bedroom, <laughs> and the bathroom. Oh, look at her wall. She destroyed the whole to get her brick. It's funny because that's literally what you do in Fortnite. Destroy the walls and get material. Put this bitch eating it. Stick her finger in. Grab some out like a booger in her nail and just I don't know man, this is a thing. We've seen people addicted to rocks, sand, sandpaper, cat hair. They like the texture or something. They like chewing it. Y'all don't like chewing gum. Y'all like chewing bricks. Y'all like that sandy texture. Mm -mm -mm. Why her grandma's bedroom though? Bitch, that's just rude. Grandma's probably so old, she don't even know what's going on. She's like, what happened to my wall? This is the poster I used to cover up the evidence. I use different tools, screwdrivers, scissors, whatever I can to get the brick out. What? She made a whole big thing in the wall. You can't just like go down the street, go to a building and just hammer it down. You gotta do it in your own house. Look at that mess. It's everywhere. Would you want a late night snack? I bet you go downstairs, pick some up off the ground. Mmm. Imagine eating that. I don't know about you guys. I mean, I like a lot of food, but this, mmm. Ugh. Brick is made out of raw materials like clay and sand. Ingesting it can cause intestinal blockage and fractured teeth. Ooh, I want to see her teeth. That's the best part. It's like all these people that eat this freaky shit, they got some nice teeth. So far, I have no physical problems from eating brick and even my teeth are in good condition. Damn, she flexing out here like, Fuck the doctors. Y'all trying to tell me this ain't good for me? Look at me, hair done, nails done, I'm feeling good. <laughs> I find it very disheartening. Look at the way she just walks and like, caresses the wall. She thinking about taking it out for dinner first, like, ooh, baby, you look good. I'm gonna come back with my screwdriver and hammer and let me get a piece of you. Looking at it like a piece of meat. A doctor could diagnose her now as perfectly fine but we don't know what it could do 10, 20 years down the line. I've eaten bricks for 12 years already, so another 12 years won't hurt. Ah, oh, that's what you think. That's what you think. All right, so this is a thing. She is not the only one with this addiction. You hear that, Patrice? You ain't special. We got this dude, and he ain't a pussy. He eats bricks. Whole, raw, trying to be all bougie, cutting it up, having it in a little cup. Nah, he eats it straight up. Took a 
a damn bite. At the end of the day, that whole thing's gonna be gone. He's just chilling with his kid too. Like, Daddy, why are you eating a rock? What's wrong with you? <laughs> from a rare eating disorder, which makes him crave bricks, mud, and gravel. The 30-year-old from Karnataka, India, has been consuming the unusual diet since he was 10. Look at that look he's giving me! Like, bitch, you really gonna judge me right now. I like brick and mud and gravel, and I'm gonna sit here and eat it. But you really gotta make that eye contact with me. It's like he judging me for everything I've ever eaten. Like, bitch, you like pizza? What's wrong with you? Eat a damn rock or something. Consuming the unusual diet since he was 10. I've never been stared down and judged so hard. <laughs> He's making me uncomfortable. <laughs> So he can't help it. It's an addiction. He needs it. He can't stop, even if he wanted to. One like equals one respect for my dude. Pick here, rapper Hana Gandhi. I'm a bad and 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 I'm a Chicken. He knows. He knows. Fried chicken is my favorite food. There is nothing I love more than fried chicken. And even he acknowledges that. But you hear him, boy needs his mud. His mom trying to pull it from him like, nah, son, what is this? What are you doing? Unagundi claims to consume around one brick a day, as well as eating up to two kilos of mud and gravel. Bro! Do you see what he just picked up? I don't know about you guys, but I don't think that was a rock. Look where it's chilling. Yeah, okay. I mean, it must be nice to just be able to like walk around your village and pick up food. <laughs> like a damn video game. <laughs> the strange habit attracts attention wherever he goes. Yeah, it's attracting attention because he is offering rock. Like, hey, yo, man, you want some rock? It's like hella good. I love it. I live off this stuff. And they're like, nah, man, what's wrong with you? You uncultured swine. I own her country, Baldur today. And the Rally Uru Halu Mono Tinta is a room. What the hell happened to this dude? It looks like he offered him the rock. I was like, hell no, nah, I don't eat that shit. And he smacked him with it. I'm getting Bala Binodi, Bala, Bijar, and Sir. Hunigundi works as a laborer, but struggles to make ends meet. He attempts to supplement his income by performing to visitors to the village at weekends. Friends and family now want him to stop the habit for the good of his health. How lit would that be? Just sitting and eating your favorite food in front of an audience and people pay you money for it. <laughs> The gravel is the worst, in my opinion. Gravel people f***ing step on that, animals do their business in it. Even the humans probably do their business in it too. And he's just eating it. Ugh, it's like cereal to him. But despite the pleas of loved ones, Hunagundi is adamant he will continue. You're telling me he lives on rocks and mud and shit? Like he doesn't eat anything else. He's saying he doesn't like anything else, but does he not eat anything else? How is he living? You know, this is legit though. Like you see him actually chewing it up and eating it. Like the My Strange Addiction shit, they don't show it that in depth. I mean, this is like a very in depth thing. <laughs> You know what he should do? He should put that shit on YouTube. Or like, just make a thumbnail like this. Eating bricks, mukbang. All right, all right. I think we need something a little more normal. Nat Holland is a 19-year-old from Manchester with a dream. She longs to open a restaurant serving traditional pub. You tell me, she 19? They're probably like, so how old are you? 19. <laughs> no, I'm actually like 35. So she wants to be a chef. But the problem is she won't eat any of her food because she only eats one kind of food. There's only one food that Nat can bear to eat, and that's burnt sausage. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Dangerous job burning sausage. Bro! I don't know about you guys, I love burnt meat. <laughs> This is very relatable. I love my meat cooked like this. Not where it's burnt, but where it's this gorgeous orange color. So good. I don't know why I like burnt sausage. I think it stems down to the fact that I know it's cooked. Every time I have sausages, I like that. Okay, that's like burnt. A little too burnt for me. Wouldn't have them any less done. I mean, I like things well done, but not burnt. I mean, it must have an horrible taste, yet she seems to thrive on them. She just likes them. 
The truth is, Nat's a sausage junkie, addicted to the cheapest sausages around. I'm not gonna lie, that looks hella good. Just mm, white bread, ketchup, and sausages. Don't don't judge her. I'm about to go make this right now. The only other food she can eat is instant mash, baked beans, chips, mm -mm -mm. and bread, but only by adding a generous portion of her beloved sausages, creating culinary masterpieces in the process. It's nice like to have. Sunday lunch, I have my sausage mash. Look how fancy she makes it. She gotta have her sausages and her mashed potato and her bread. Cause it's similar, it looks similar. Same with pizza, I made What the pizza. hell is that? She just made pizza with sausages and macaroni? There's macaroni and sausages on her pizza. Okay, this is actually making me really hungry, so I'm gonna just like end this video and I'm gonna make my ass some food. But anyways, that's all for today. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button in the face if you want more of these Freaky food videos. Comment below, would you ever eat bricks? Have you ever tried bricks? Don't try it. Please don't. And make sure you subscribe, join the wolf pack. Oh, I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.